It's an engineering marvel happening under our feet and tonight there's been a breakthrough for Sydney's Metro West Line. It's a crucial addition the public will never see up close, but we have the exclusive pictures. The latest breakthrough came today at Clyde. After a year of digging a tunnel, passengers will never travel through, just trains as they start and end their shifts. Create what will effectively become the on-ramp, connecting our trains from the stabling and maintenance facility at Clyde onto the 25 kilometre twin tunnels. And carry the cables connecting the future control centre to the network. Also watching the road header surface today, four-year-old Teddy Smith, who named it? It was Rhonda. Who's Rhonda? Nana. For Rhonda's biggest sisters, it's now peak digging season under Claremont Meadows for the line connecting St Mary's to the new airport. Joining Rhonda right now, there are eight machines boring through Sydney, including Beatrice and Daphne at Five Dock, Betty and Dorothy near Olympic Park, with Catherine, Marlene, Peggy and Eileen working the Western Sydney Airport Metro. Rhonda isn't finished yet. Next, it'll be digging a second tunnel from here down to the main line work that should be finished by May when it would have dug out some 300,000 tonnes of earth. Adding a station next door at Rose Hill Racecourse for a potential housing development still to be locked in. Negotiations are ongoing, but the potential for an extra 25,000 extra homes with open space and a brand new metro station is an incredible opportunity. Paul Kadak, 7 News.